Scripture, the finest frontier. These are the voyages of Skylab Omega. It's five month mission to spread the gospel across the galaxy, to share God's love with civilization, to boldly go where one savior has gone before. Come with us now as we blast through the Bible with Commander Cosmos, Space Ranger. Let's see, we got three crates of frozen broccoli, check. We got 500 gallons of lemonade, check. And 1,000 boxes of chocolatey cocoa puffs, check, check, check. Oh, hello there. Welcome aboard Skylab Omega. Oh, I am Lieutenant Dan Sonicloud. What are your names? Oh, that's a lot of names. I'm going to have to check the flight records here. All right. I was just taking the pre-flight inventory. <laughs> We're about to take off on a very important mission. <laughs> I'm just waiting for the commander to, uh, to finish his system checks. <laughs> oh, there he is now. He loves to be announced. Uh, so all hands on deck for Commander Cosmos, Space Ranger. Oh! <laughs> I meant to do that. At ease, men. Commander Cosmos, Space Ranger! At your service. <laughs> so, are, are, are we ready to take off? Soon, Lieutenant. Soon. Uh, did, you, did you finish your flight checks? All systems are go. Well, then we can take off. Uh, in due time. In due time. But I thought that we were taking off today. <laughs> it's, I'm really excited. It's my first big mission. I'm so excited to go into space and see the galaxy. <laughs> I'm going to get the computers ready and, 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 the, and, and the engines and all. Patience, Lieutenant. Patience. We have to wait. But what are we waiting for? Our marching orders. But I thought the commander gave the orders into, you're the commander. Of this vessel? Yeah. But there is a supreme authority, and I must listen to his orders and obey every step he tells me to take. Is it God? It is! <laughs> and I always check his flight manual before I take a single move, so let me get it out right now. Amen. Wow, is that a songbook? Oh, so much more important than that. This is God's holy Bible. I like to call it my flight manual oh. because I never take a step without first checking God's word and asking him to show me his plan. <laughs> but that book is thousands of years old. How can it tell us what to do today? <laughs> Why, Dan Sonicloud, <laughs> you, you surprise me. Don't you know that the Spirit of God is bigger than time and space? Oh, yeah. The Bible says Jesus is the same yesterday, today, and forever. Uh, so Jesus has a message for us today. God always has a message. Huh. Ah, here it is. The message takes place after Jesus died and rose again. Oh, yeah. Jesus rose again and visited all of his disciples. Jesus appeared to many followers over a period of 40 days. But on one occasion, he said to them, Do not leave Jerusalem, but wait Ow. for the gift my father promised. All of this waiting again. What, what, what did he want him to wait for? What was the gift anyway? Open up the virtual Bible and we can all read it together. Ah, uh, uh, Commander, accessing virtual Bible. Ah, there it is. You will receive power when the Holy Spirit comes on you and you will be my witnesses in Jerusalem and in all Judea and Samaria and to the ends of the earth. Oh, so the gift was the Holy Spirit. Yes, and Jesus gave them an important mission, and he instructed them not to leave until they had the power to fulfill that mission. Huh. And do you know where that power comes from? Uh, the Holy Spirit? Exactly! <laughs> well, what exactly is the Holy Spirit? The Holy Spirit is God. The Holy Spirit is that part of God that helps us to know what he wants us to do next. The Holy Spirit 
points us towards Jesus. Well, hey, that's just what we need. That's what everyone needs. Hey, so did Jesus give them the Holy Spirit right then and there? No. Jesus was lifted up into heaven right before their very eyes. What? He promised them the Holy Spirit and then just left up into heaven? It was time for him to go back to his Father in heaven. Huh, but, but what about the Holy Spirit? When will they get the Holy Spirit? Remember what Jesus told them? Wait. Oh, all this waiting is making me anxious. <laughs> come in. Come in, Commander Cosmos. Hello. Wait. Hello. We're getting a message. Oh, hello, Lieutenant. Hi. <laughs> Thank you both so much for your patience. I am below deck, and I have our mission plan ready. Oh, great, we can take off. Wait, first, let me tell you the mission. We are to start on the planet Jerusalem, okay. in the Judean solar system, yeah. in the galaxy of Samaria. God. Excellent, we have space stations all over that galaxy. Yes, and they are badly in need of the truth about Jesus. Our mission is to carry God's word to all of them and to the ends of the earth and the universe. Awesome. <laughs> well, what are you waiting for? Get below deck and strap in. I'm initiating launch sequence now. <laughs> all right, well, sequence. let's take off. Ten, See you next time, kids. Nine, and remember, eight, Jesus is the seven, same yesterday, six, today, five, and forever. Four, three, two, one, launch.